Hi there again, my lovely friends. I'm glad you could stop by. And if you're here today for the Juvia's Place, the Berries Palette Review, uh, this is the place to be. If you're new to my channel, great to have you. I'd love to see you do a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button below and stick around and continue with my makeup journey. Anyways, let's talk about the Juvia's Place, the Berries. This is very hand-picked, rich berry palette and it is not kidding. I have the look on right now uh, using all of the colors in here with the exception of dipping into my uh, Violet Voss Sugar Crystals where I use just a little color right on there just in the middle of my, um, my eyelid just for that little pop of color. Um, this is, um, as I said, this is from uh, Juvia's Place. It is $14. It is 13.2 grams or point four seven ounces. It has a 24 month uh, shelf life and it's very opaque when you put it on. Uh, so use a very light uh, hand when you use it and just make sure you build it up and it, you would not believe how ginormous these pans are. And especially for this price point, which, oh, have I told you? $14. Okay. And Juvia's Place is a lovely brand. I don't think it's getting all the loving that it needs. And it is up and coming. And I think it's going to make hit mainstream pretty soon. But it is absolutely gorgeous. And this is very budget friendly. And I want to let you know that there's two shadows in here that have an eye warning. Um, so just kind of be aware of that. This is one of the... Um, the various uh, series they have where it has like the color tones. They have the chocolates, the nudes, they have the violets, they have the vanilla, and this one right here, the berries. So I think this is going to be a great addition. This one spoke to me. Um, I love colors, and this one is absolutely incredible. Look at that. Isn't that going just dreamy? Um, this is not a standalone by no means. This is something that can, you know, if you're really looking into berries, this is the place to be. So here's what the front cover is. I love the artwork and I love the theme of it. It is absolutely gorgeous. And then here's the back. And let's jump on board. So it has the cardboard, nice magnetic closure, and then no mirror, but I'm okay with that, especially at $14. And look at that. Isn't that just gorgeous? Those are some beautiful colors. And as I said, this is not a standalone. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> this is not a standalone whatsoever. This is just if you want that those berry colors, this is something you should stop by on. And it really spoke to me. And let me tell you which, which colors in here have that... Um, that uh, color warning. It's number one here and then number five. And in like ColourPop, they have in it hasn't passed FDA uh, for you know apparently for in the near eye area because of the highly pressed pigments. So they say don't put it near your eye, but it's eye makeup, which doesn't make sense. And it's only in a few states, which is the United States, I believe Canada, and I forget one other place. So just let's take a peek at this and let's jump on board. So anyways, let's take some swatches here. It doesn't have names on it, but look at this. This is a beautiful mat. And let me put it on the back of my hand. <sighs> then here's this one, which is another berry, but it's a little bit lighter, more of a pink. Oh, look at those. Oh, and then we have the next one right here, which is number three. Look at that. And then let me put it on. Nice little coppery berry. I think that's just gorgeous. Look at that. That's the first row. Then let's go to the next one. And look at that. Oh, look at this. Oh, geez. Look at this. Look at that. I love this one here that looks kind of like a grape. Oh, that is just dreamy. And you know what? They are really pretty. I had no problem working with them. Uh, they are really pigmented. They go on really soft and creamy. I love their, um, their formula. And you know what? People just rave about it. And 
this is a great addition to my collection. I like having palettes that have that continual theme of a certain color so that way you don't have to reach from this palette to that palette to this one to get the look you want. And look how beautiful it is. And look how it makes my eyes pop. <laughs> so anyways, just my final thoughts. I think this is fantabulous. I think $14 is a great price for this. I'm okay that it doesn't have a mirror, but I love the workmanship and the thought process and the concept of it. I think it's really beautiful. And oh, by the way, don't forget it's uh, cruelty free. And I highly recommend you use a really light hand and then just build it up because it does have some pigmentation on it and has really nice large pans think it's fabulous so anyways let me know if you have this in your collection and what your thoughts are about it Oz. and hope you have a fabulous one and don't forget a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button below and i'd really appreciate it and see you in the next video have a fabulous one